Major changes to our everyday lives are a matter of hours away with new rules. Family events like weddings, what? funerals will be dramatically scaled down. Barbecues are now You've off the table. Joking. It's very difficult to put a number on Fuck. it. But the point about it is this. If you're gathering together in a group, say 10 people together outside in a group, that's not OK. It's the end of the great Aussie barbecue with our social lives now put on hold, basically. Let's bring in today reporter Ashlyn Kellis in Brisbane. Ashlyn, good morning to you. Plenty of events off the table now. Carl, for now, there'll be no birthday parties, no celebrations or gatherings in homes or parks. As you said, we can't even have a simple barbecue with our mates in the backyard. Our social lives are changing in every way imaginable. It's going to be such a lonely time for so many people. Carl, it seems more important than ever to check in with friends and family members. But for now, it will have to be via a message or a phone call, not in person. We've got a very simple message today. Stay at home. This is critically important. We cannot have people out socialising, gathering as if this wasn't happening. The restrictions that have been put in place have been very challenging and particularly as Easter um, provides an opportunity for families usually to come together. The extension of the state of emergency uh, continued for a further four weeks. But Victoria is refusing to relax the rules. Catching up with mates in the park and getting out on the water for a barbecue. In other parts of Australia, normality appears to be making a return. Victoria has done things differently to other jurisdictions. Victoria is still the toughest when it comes to stay-at-home restrictions, as other states start easing up.